I know I'm late to this, but I think that all of the girlies, you know, the lip filler, I make plenty of money, BBL, I'm high maintenance because I can maintain myself, not caring about marriage or relationships because I can have whatever man whenever I want, so I ain't worried about it right now, you know, those girlies. I want y'all to pay attention to what Vivica Fox got going on right now. Vivica Fox is 59 years old. She still look good to me. 59 years old on a national interview talking about, can you hook me up? You got anybody? And I don't discriminate. I date them all. You got somebody? You want to help me find a man? Girl, help me find a man. Basically begging because she don't want to be alone no more. I want y'all to remember that at one point in time, Vivica Fox was that girl. She had her pick of any man. She was doing her thing in Hollywood, making plenty of money. And she has openly admitted multiple times that she has ruined some good relationships because she thought she had plenty of time to find another one. That she wasn't worried about finding love because she was wealthy and doing well in life. And she has been in relationships that she ruined because she had men who wanted to take care of her and she didn't know how to allow a man to be a man. And so she ruined those relationships. That sounds real familiar, doesn't it? We're seeing that play out today. And for all the people saying that Vivica Fox looks bad, I want y'all to remember that those lip injections, cheek injections, that plastic surgery, it alters how you age. This is a mirror of what some of y'all are going to look like as gravity and age takes a hold. Just keep that in mind. You might want to stop now while you're ahead. Because I understand that you are a high maintenance girly and you love your lip fillers and you love your cheek fillers and I don't have any lines. You're supposed to have certain lines as you age. And y'all keep doing all of this stuff to y'all's bodies. Y'all keep believing that you got the rest of your life to find love. I want you to remember that there is a new batch of women that come out every day. And it's not that we're in competition with one another. But why would a man pick you at 59 years old, body deteriorating because you haven't treated it well, because you done filled it full of foreign substances? Why would a man pick you after you have told all of the men, not you, I don't want you, I'm such and such, I got it, I'm cool, don't worry about it. Why would they pick you now? Back then, they didn't want me, now I'm hot, they all on me. Please remember that the tables turn. Y'all think about that.